Hi, Sophie King, John back again in Kitchen of Dreams. Yeah, another attempt of a perfect draft review. What I'm going to review just now is, you see above, the Lone Brown, Oktoberfest. 6.1 on the Richter scale for this bad boy. So let's get the culprit in the glass. See what it's all about. Wow. Whoa, wow. Whoa, don't overflow. You cheeky mouthful, well. So here we have. It's going to go everywhere now. Epic fail. So here we have the culprit in the glass. Big Steinfall of the, the low and brow. Was a, I used to know, I used to work in a pub in Glasgow years ago, uh, way back in the early 90s, and it was the, the granary in Shawlands, and they used to have it on draft, and we used to call it laughing brow. You had a, a five or six pints yet, you were laughing. So anyway, let's, the copper in the glass, usual, 6.1, uh, life going up the glass, I don't know if you're getting it or not. A lot of chill haze on the glass, usual, very dark, dark light in here as well because it's not a very nice day uh, up here in north. So let's, what are we getting? I always get with these German beers, I always get that sort of like, everybody says the bread. I, I automatically think pretzel, that lovely big doughy pretzel you get in the German beer halls. Pretzel. Lots of malt. No suggestion. No suggestion right away. You can get a lot of these continental lagers, especially when they're, they're over the 6%. You've got that sweet smell. You're not getting that at all. So anyway, so freaking drunk drinking. A lone brow. Octoberfest 2022. 6.1 on a Richter still. This one's going out to everybody. Prost. Slangy fight the rest of the boys out there. <laughs> Firstly, big smack of bread. It's like, it is that pretzel. The nice we'll get a pretzel in the UK is when you go down to Lidl's and you buy them for about 49 pence, but even those, they're quite good as well. It's like a salty bread. It's a Moorish bread. Uh, sharp, clean. And then suddenly you've got that right, that backbone of malt that's running right through the beer. Nice and strong. It's actually a meal in a glass, to be honest with you. It's a meal in a glass. I reviewed the other Oktoberfest one, the Spaten. And that was quality, but I know I've kept the main event to last to review and this is the main event this I'm going to go right out now and say Lohan Brow on the PD the ordinary Lohan Brow is my favourite beer it's the best beer for me on the PD that I've tried uh, this is a step above it this is up there this is the one that if this was available all year round and it was £10 a keg dearer I'd be buying this. Uh, it's nice. The other one is an outstanding beer, but this is just, this is head and shoulders above it. It's an absolute classic. What more can you say about it? It's just German engineering. Uh, the Germans are like brutal lager. I'm sorry, but a lot of people, they'll say the Czechs and like that. For me, it, in, the, in the Olympics of beer, uh, the Poles come in third. Now, a lot of people might be shocked at that. And then it's the Czechs who give us Pilsners. They give us that. They give us that, the Pilsner style of beer. But the Germans, the Germans are just masters of their craft. Outstanding. Absolutely outstanding. You just drink that all day. Unfortunately, you only get 10 pints of it in a PD keg. It's what, 10 pints of that, and it cost me 36 quid, £3.60. But then again, you'll have all your bolt-ons, your extras, your 
keg back return and all that kind of stuff but even if you bought that and you didn't have all that kind of stuff £3.60 for a beer like that or you go down to your local city centre wherever you are in the UK and you pay four quid maybe five quid I was in Newcastle there recently and it was five quid for a beer that's standard and that was anything five quid for a beer £3.60 for that you drink it in the kitchen of dreams or drink it in your sitting room of dreams or whatever your bedroom of dreams or your park bench of the dreams you know what I'm saying this is absolutely outstanding your back garden full of dreams well, here we are. The list is endless. The list is endless. You can drink good quality beer, but three pound sixty a pint. That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. I bought that. Like it's got a big mass. Seven pound twenty to fill that. That's the way you look at it. So anyway, is it one? I'm going to drink again. Always, I'm going to drink that. I've actually got one bottle of this left. Uh, and I'm going to drink that as well. I'm going to actually go up against it. I'm going to do. I'm going to do a comparison and see what it's like. What I did discover with <coughs> this one over the spaten Oktoberfest on the PD was it was a wee bit more gassy. I didn't find the the spaten uh, a lot of gas in it, but this one, yeah, I had a few pints here last night. You know, sitting watching TV and. I could feel the, the build-up of gas, but phew, still a drinking treat. German efficiency, German engineering, the Germans, they know how to brew beer. So anyway, is it one I'm going to drink again? Yes, it will be. I will go back to this next year when it comes back out. Do another comparison and see what it's like. Uh, this. So what am I going to give the Lone Brow 2022? 6.1 Oktoberfest Lager. I'm going to give that a Sofa King Drunk rating of, I'm going to give that a 4.99999 out of 5. No, it's not actually. No, it's not, it's a 9999 <laughs> out of 10. Well, it doesn't matter. It's a ball hair away from perfection. That's what that is. German engineering. And listen, any of you guys out there, just... Just swirling, oh, should I, should I, no, should I, just go and get it. If you like lager, that, that to me is the best lager on the PD. That is, if that was available all year round, I'd be buying it. But it's not available all year round. It's only available maybe a couple of months of the year and then it'll disappear again. And something else will come out. The Ordinary Lone Brow is a top notch, which is my favourite. And I've bought that a few times. But that... It's head and shoulders, head and shoulders above it. So anyway, if you've had the uh, Oktoberfest, Lone, Lone Brow, Laughing Brow, whatever you want to call it, 6.1 on Richter Scale, Oktoberfest 2022 beer on the PD. You liked it, you didn't like it. If you didn't like that, you're not, you're not a lager drinker. That's what I'm going to say. Please leave a comment below. I'm not asking you to smash or like or subscribe. I don't do that because that's not me. Well, I just done it, didn't I? Well, I did. Well, yeah, well, okay, then. I did. <laughs> and if you stuck along at the end of the video, Yavol, Slangy Va, Prost, and hopefully Sofa King John will catch you in an RPD review real soon. Slangy Va, keep drinking the good German beers out there. Ciao for now. Auf Wiedersehen! Pet.